Hello everyone, welcome to Soda Saturday for today, Saturday, September 15th, and well at this point guys, you pretty much know I have a passion for cherry soda. So for today's cherry soda review, we are going to review a highball black cherry energy drink. Found this at a Rite Aid store, and let's look at it. It looks interesting, uh, although really the only colors on it are black and red. Obviously the highball logo, uh, just like a star used for a dash. It's an organic energy drink, and it's also a USDA organic. It also says right here, organic cherry juice, <clears throat> organic cherry juice, organic caffeine, and organic sugar. You can see it right there. And also, it's fair trade certified ingredient. Everything else is pretty much just that. Oh, and also it has organic guarana, organic ginseng, B vitamins, Organic cherry juice and caffeine. You get the drift. So, obviously, without further ado, let's get this guy open, if it really does. Hmm. Huh. This smells different than most cherry sodas I've had. It actually doesn't really smell like Mountain Dew Game Fuel, Citrus Cherry, or Stewart's Cherry, which I tend to categorize them in different taste methods. In other words, uh, Stewart's Black Cherry and uh, Rockstar Cherry taste the same, while Mountain Dew Game Fuel Citrus Cherry and Amp Energy Cherry Blast taste the same. This, hmm, smelling it can smell a little hint of the Stewart's Cherry, but I don't know. Stewart's Cherry Soda is a lot darker, but here the product I'm looking at here is a little lighter. I'd show the camera on it, but let's just get to the review. Mm. Mm. Ladies and gentlemen, I think I found my worst cherry soda ever. My least favorite. Yep. Move down, Sprite Cherry. You got a new winner. This tastes like a mixture of the organic Amp Energy flavors that I've had with cherry juice. So I'm guessing that that's just a common theme, that they're organic and that they taste different from regular cherry soda. This just does not have any wins in my eyes. It just tastes... Ugh. I don't like it. I do not like it at all. So yeah. I will say, though, it's far tamer to some of the other soda choices down the list. In terms of the ranking, though, I'd give it a 1 out of 5. So, yeah. Sorry, Highball, you're not going to be off the shelf again anytime soon. Alright then, thank you all for watching, folks, and see you later.